Before you watch my interaction, please head over to Rooster Teeth's main channel on YouTube for to see this content for yourself, or you can go over to the site at roosterteeth.com to go watch the content for yourself as well. If you sign up for their first program, you can see episodes a week before they hit YouTube or any kind of public domain or whatever. Um, and it also supports the content that we all love and enjoy. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and enjoy the reaction. Welcome back to some more Camp Camp Season 2, Episode 11, uh, Cooking Cookies. Um, and I had the three girls uh, from the, uh, the Girl Scouts, um, or the... What are they called again? <laughs> I can't remember now. Um, the Flower Scouts, there we go. Um, so it's going to be interesting to see what what that's all about. Um, so I'm just going to jump right into it. So without further ado, let's do it. Here we go. Good Flower morning, Scouts. Good morning, Miss Cross. Now who can tell me what starts today? Oh, snap. Flower Scout Cookie Sales. Yes. And <laughs> yes. Trump is going to sell the most? Troop 789. All right. 789. And why are we going to do it? Because, because you'd rather die than let that bitch Susie Mendez make you look bad in front of the other garden mothers. Damn. Exactly. <laughs> and as your garden mother, I'm excited to tell you that this year, the Flower Scouts organization has included a grand prize for the troop that sells the most cookies in the country. And all expense paid trip to Cabo! <gasps> OMG! I heard Cabo was like the best beaches. <laughs> yes, Russ, are you for serious? <laughs> Interrupting is rude and ugly. Sorry. <laughs> Jesus. Now you girls are gonna sell skinny minties, lemon lilies, and coconut cream candy tufts until every last loser and sleepy peak has diabetes. Jesus. You need that vacation. Good luck with that, ladies. Ew. It's a wood scout. Oh, yeah. What do you the losers cookie want? sale kind of we thing. We nearly wanted to offer you the last box of wood scouts popcorn. Nobody likes your shitty caramel corn, wood scouts. Get lost. Oh, but I beg to differ. In fact, we just sold 99% of our popcorn supply to the good people of Sleepy Peak. You did what? You annoying girls beat us to the punch every year with your cookies. So we decided to rearrange our sales schedule. No one's going to want cookies when they're already filled up on popcorn. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Jeremy, I told you to stay in the van. You forgot <laughs> to crack the window. I didn't forget anything. <laughs> Come on, boys. Let's leave the little ladies to their humiliating defeat. Try to kill really, them. You're gonna want to roll down the window. God, I hate you. Ugh, I can't even with them. What about Cabo? <laughs> what are we gonna do, ladies? What about Cabo? And sell some cookies. By any means necessary. Damn. A place where you and I can stay, where we can go to laugh and play. Have adventures every day. I know it sounds hard to believe, but that's because it's true. The camel is the place for me and you. Lakes and climb up trees, catch fish, bugs, bears, and honeybees. There's endless possibilities, and no, that's not hyperbole. Our mottos can't play DM. Oh my gosh. I wonder if all the other Girl Scouts, because uh, we saw two, two other groups besides the main group that we've seen before, um, all the other kids, I, I wonder if they are with the same girl um, who does the, the Flower Scout, the, the, the trio. Because um, there's one girl who does the voice for all three of the main girls. Um, these Flower girls. Scout cookies. Flower Scout cookie sales! We've got your Flower Scout! Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> Jesus. Asha, calm down. Stress causes wrinkles. This is bullshit, Aaron. Since when do we have to work to sell cookies? As long as I'm cute and beautiful, people should give me what I want. Maybe everyone did fill up on popcorn. Or maybe they're all freaked out by your disgusting eye patch tattoo. <laughs> oh, monster! <laughs> did she lose her eye, though? Garden mommy has a wine headache. A Mr. wine Russ, headache. This isn't working. Tomato juice? What should we do? I'm gonna eat my feelings. Girls. You can't survive in this world on good looks alone. <sighs> Liar! I'm just saying that sometimes you have to do some extra work to make things better. Things like my face. Vodka. Or my breakfast. Maybe she's right. Maybe if we just work a little harder, we can better ourselves and achieve our goals. Erin, I know Miss Pris is the ideal role model, but you sound really stupid right now. Yeah, idiot. You're right, I'm sorry. <laughs> We're not the problem. Obviously, it's these hella lame cookies. They haven't changed since, like, the 90s. Should we can somehow make them better. 
Oh, that's better. What's that, Miss Press? Disoxin. What's disoxin? Um. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Sugar. Like Mexican cane sugar? Mexican cane sugar is totes super popular right now. That's right. No one wants that nasty corn syrup stuff when they can have organic sugar from an exotic third world country. Miss Pris, can we have your sugar? <laughs> oh, oh, heavens no. Girls, Miss Pris gets her sugar special from her sugar daddy. It's very <laughs> expensive. God. But we need... <laughs> but Sell cookies for Cabo, girls. Penelope's going to Muffin Tops and writing up breakfast. I was in beauty pageants. <laughs> we need right. that sugar. Ugh. I can't believe we have to work. We just have to find a way to get Miss Pris away from her purse. How? <laughs> Jesus. One box of wine, please. <laughs> well, that was easy. Good thinking with the Merlot, Aaron. It's pronounced Merlot. Learn French, Tabby. <laughs> Eyes on the prize, Merlot. girl. The camera keeps, like, falling a little bit, I guess. Here we go. Nope, wait. All right, girls. It's time to sell some. Flower Scout cookies! Oh, no thank you. It's a brand new formula. Baked fresh with real Mexican cane sugar. Smell that organic goodness. I... Smell it! <laughs> Um, yes, they smell very good. Oh, very good. I'll take 20. <laughs> oh, I fucking love these cookies. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. The entire city is going to be like a high on like. Um, I think we might need to make more cookies. Like crack Shit. meth or whatever. Now what are we supposed to do? We can't sell a troop's worth of cookies without more cane sugar. Ugh, this is so annoying. I guess now we have to track down Miss Press's sugar daddy. But how? Her phone probably. One cell phone, please. <laughs> Still passed out. Yeah, I'm just holding for a friend. Calm down, sugar daddy. <laughs> Penny, is that you? Miss Pris couldn't make it. You're dealing with us now. <laughs> Little girls, I ain't interested in buying nothing. Well, we are Mexican cane sugar. The good shit. <laughs> uh, right, cane sugar. Look, Dirty Kevin don't sell to no kids. Dirty Kevin. You do now. <laughs> so, you not a vape? Oh my gosh. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Not good enough. Oh my god. <laughs> Was he putting on hamburgers? <laughs> oh my god, smashing the cookie and like snorting it. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, Mr. White. What do you mean we're losing business? We're the goddamn Mexican drug cartels. <laughs> Who are we losing business to? Well, Mr. Guzman, our people are calling them Las Diablitas. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I think this was the thumbnail. I didn't I didn't look too much into it. I just saw the three girls there. I didn't know they were like on top of like <laughs> a cookie like throne or something. <laughs> Jesus Christ. We got a problem. Uh, Boss. <laughs> what is it now? <laughs> well, it seems this whole cookie operation has upset some powerful people south of the border. Like in Mexico? Ew. Can we just build a wall around that place already? <laughs> Jesus. The cartels ain't too happy about our uh, sugar sales. They want to meet face to face. What should I tell them? Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even know Mexico had rich people. It's probably fake. They do the same thing when Americans go to North Korea. <laughs> this is smart, Aaron. Let's wrap this up so we can get out of this hollow broke country. Jesus Christ. I swear, if one more street boy tries to sell me gum, I'm going to flip. So we're in Mexico um, right now. Buenos dias. We're here to see Senior Guzman. Las Diablitas? Hey! Okay, the hell did you just say to me? Las Diablitas. <laughs> so, you three are the ones who have been causing us such trouble. <clears throat> it was foolish of you to come. What the hell? Hold on. <laughs> are you saying that 
I'm stupid. Someone get this monster away from me. <laughs> that guy's just freaking me out. Abby, down. Listen oh up, my God. amigos. We don't know what your beef <laughs> is with our sales. If anything, you should be thanking us for supporting the economy of your gross-ass country. What is she talking about? Hit him! What the oh, fuck? <laughs> Jesus! Oh my god. Now, I'm going to ask all of you wow. users this once and only once. You really want to fuck with these batches? <laughs> okay, would you like to buy some cookies? We will buy. We will buy all of them, right? <laughs> see, see, see. Oh my god. Hey. Thank you. Ugh, this has been the worst cookie gear ever. But on the bright side, we should finally have enough money to go to Cabo. Cabo! <laughs> but you're already in Cabo. <laughs> what did you say? I, I said you're already in Cabo. Uh, no, this is Mexico. Mexico? See, si, see, si. Cabo San Lucas. This is where I live. Wait, Cabo is a city? In Mexico? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Waste of time. Ugh, uh, I can't believe we were trying to win just a it to gross ass Mexico. Seriously. <laughs> Keep it down, girls. Garden Mommy has a wine headache. Do you guys think there's <laughs> anything to be, like, learned from all this? Damn it, Vicky. <laughs> I told you to pull up. What the heck? Yeah. Thank God we live normal lives unlike <laughs> those losers. What the heck? Alrighty then. <laughs> making dollars, you ain't gotta make a lot of sense. Look, I started at the bottom, couldn't leave a Starting the voices. Okay, hold on. Um Dirty Kevin Rocco. Or Roke. Okay, I think it's Rocco. Um Platypus. Yeah, no Platypus. Um I was trying to remember uh, the other girls. I think it's all Seth, Samantha, uh, the voice of um, Nora. Um, but yeah, Snake. <laughs> Yeah, it's, I'm, I'm sure it's all uh, Sam. I'm 100% sure it's all Sam. That's hilarious. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's a silly episode. That's hilarious. Oh my gosh. Um, yeah, that was hilarious. Um, it was like sort of like like I love the part when like they're like beating up like uh the Breaking Bad character uh, Mr. White when he's like they're like <laughs> it's like it's like your this isn't your turf oh, like like this isn't your turf anymore or something like that when they're like just beating the crap out of him like ah! <laughs> um oh my gosh there's so many good uh, good parts in this uh the throwing of cookies and money and stuff that was <laughs> so freaking funny um oh my gosh it's so freaking hilarious. Yeah, so the last bit with, like, the plane and everything, like, I know it's supposed to be, like, a joke, because, like, you know, we missed out on their adventure today. Um, but Nikki's a pilot. Um, uh, Max has, like, a samurai hat and a samurai sword. Um, Neil's got some kind of, like, jeweled-out crown. And then the platypus has, like, a uh, Egyptian pharaoh, like, um, uh, what do they call it? Crap. It's, uh, well, it's, it's hat really but um they call it something specific remember um but yeah uh it's a funny episode jesus christ it's <laughs> so many good bits too so many freaking good bits uh the throne was hilarious um they <laughs> i loved how they just were like 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 this part right here it's hilarious Are you saying that i'm stupid <laughs> someone get this monster away from me all right, Patch is freaking me out. Tabby, down. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> like low amigos. growl you that was happening. Your beef is with our sales. And then like the whole like the ninja stars, like the cookie stars or whatever. Um, that was freaking hilarious. Oh my god, it just like immediately turned into like <laughs> like a robbery or whatever. Oh my god, <clears throat> that escalated so freaking quickly. <laughs> <laughs> it was it was supposed to be like cookie sales, like you know, uh, selling good Girl Scout cookies, yeah, kind of thing. Um, and I, I loved how they the brought back the fact that um, uh, the Boy Scouts um, 
uh, I can't remember what they call them, just the Boy Scouts, they're not the Boy Scouts, they're like something else, um, I, I remember, I, I love how they referenced, um, their new information that they gathered from, uh, um, Kip Campbell, um, when, um, ah, shoot, <laughs> when the one, uh, counselor, um, uh, why did I go ahead forget her name? Jesus Christ, I'm, I'm so mad at myself. Um, uh, anyways, when she gave um, the information to uh, the Boy Scouts um, about the uh, cookie sales and to like, move it like a month or something like that, um, I'm glad they brought that back like in this episode. And this is like the, the drastic state they have to like do in order to like get up to those sales again. Um, and going to Mexico and everything, going to Cabo is hilarious. Like They didn't even know they were just going there. Um, freaking hilarious. Oh, man. All right. So, next episode, uh, will be next week, uh, hopefully. Um, like I said, it's, uh, I always say in all my videos, it's kind of, it's going to be interesting to see if they ever take a break, like a mid-season break kind of thing, like they do with, uh, Ruby, uh, the main volumes and everything. Um, but, uh, who knows? I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. So, yeah. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next week for some more Camp Camp Season 2. Take care, buddy. When the lights in the house crash out with the sound of respect and pride For each side where the motherfuckers try to slide and ride and find out